what are you doing today? I mean, are you continuing to immerse yourself in the faith? Are you taking any more steps? Um, obviously, it's a, it's a constant struggle to be a faithful disciple. Um, are you doing anything to enrich your faith life today? You know, I, um, I, I, everything that I do, if I go for something, I go all the way. And this is what I did in fighting, and it helped me tremendously, because once I say to myself, I'm going to do it, I will do it. I'm not going to lie to myself. The one person you cannot lie in the world to, I always tell people, is yourself. Because once you start lying and denying, that's when addiction and all that stuff starts happening. So let your word be true. If you say yes, that's what yes be yes. So by early in the morning, I wake up at 5, around 5 o'clock. There's all already like 45 minutes of prayers. And then I go down to the gym. I do my workout. I have a long training device that I do first for five minutes and then I do a workout. Then I walk the dog. While I'm walking the dog, I do a rosary. When I come back from the from the dog, it's like a quarter to eight. I jump in my car, go to mass, daily mass. It's, I mean, 0 0.3 miles away from my uh, from my new place in Texas. I mean, it's amazing. So when I come out of mass at 8, 8.30 in the morning, I was already up for, for, for three hours. And I did a lot of work, you know, and that's the faith. And then, of course, during the day, I do the Angelus, just did it, and then you got the, the, the Divine Mercy we do. I wrap it up with a whole uh, uh, list of prayers in the evening. So if something happens in the middle of the night, that my act of contrition, that, um, that, that I'm going to be good, you know. I always make sure that you get your scapular on, and, and we're going to be good. And now also we're traveling, and with a bunch of guys also, also faithful Catholics. And in the car we're talking about Catholicism now in uh, next week. Well, the end of next week you have an, uh, a retreat. Uh, with all of us, that's a bunch of guys that we have, like 11 guys who always go to the same retreats. And we just have a, a really good time, you know. And I, people always go like, ah, oh, these guys are probably praying all day long. And they have such a wrong idea of what the faith really is, people on the outside, you know. And, and I can't blame them because it, I was exactly the same thing. I mean, if you if you spend two days with us, you're going to please put me in, coach. Let me hear. Let me be. You want to be part of that.